Outlander. Okay. All right, I want to make this quick uh, tutorial, more of a tip, and it's about how to create a reference image or bring a reference image or a reference video into Blender. That way you can use it for sculpting or whatever else. All right, first thing you want to do is basically get rid of the fl this splash screen, you know, and then I like going into front side view by pressing one and then press 5 to go into orthographic view. Now all you do is go to your reference image which I'm just going to use this as my reference image. I just grab it, drag it, bring it in, and drop it. Now you can see that this image is not uh, centered and the reason behind that is because it basically attaches it to an empty. So you need to center this empty. So basically on the x-axis bring it to zero and on the z-axis bring it to zero and now it's centered and you can do the same thing when it comes to videos I'll go ahead and delete this and let me drag in a video real quick show you what I'm talking about I could bring in this video right here do the same thing I can go ahead and center it and this video will update according to frame position also like I could scrub through the timeline and you can see the video of course I get to frame 100 and it stops now the reason why it stops is because right here uh, the object dead on well whatever tab this tab is called but basically it's set to 100 frames so if I need to reference a, a video longer than 100 frames I just need to increase the number of frames here and now it will you know go up to 779 frames anyway I hope that's useful later people thank you for watching this video here are four other videos you might like if you liked this video please give it a like share it or leave a comment I try to respond to every comment on every video regardless how old the video is. Also, please support your favorite YouTubers by disabling ad blocker. Thanks again. Later.